So a very good afternoon to y'all. I started my day off right, you guys. I woke up and I watched um Divergent. That is a very good movie. Uh, I have seen some people talk about this movie, namely Lindsay Bell from DLV. And dude, the movie is great. Like, it's such a great movie. I was like, I was very shocked because I have the book actually on my bookshelf right now. I've had it for the last six months, but I've yet to read it. So I was just like, uh, whatever, I'll watch the movie. And now I want to read the book. <laughs> So I'm going to do that. I also went outside and I spray painted the table. Now the problem with that is I don't like the color. The color doesn't match the color of the wood in my room, unfortunately. It's very like a cherry wood color versus a dark wood color. So I have to go and find a wood, I mean find a color that matches my room now so I'm gonna have to respray paint the table so I'm calling Home Depot to find out if they have the actual spray paint that I need and I've, I called before and I was hung up on so I'm calling again I've been on hold for five minutes and I was on hold eight minutes before so kind of getting annoyed with this I hate bad customer service okay guys so I am coming in my backyard so I can show you guys how the table looks before it gets dark out here. Like I said, it's too light. It doesn't match the wood in my room at all. It's like a, kind of like a cherry wood color. So it's definitely too light. So I say so a lot, but it's definitely too light. So I'm going to have to definitely go and get that other can of spray paint tomorrow. Time for Lucas walk. And the sun has already set. You can like see the moon, but it's not completely dark yet. I wanted to catch the sunset, but I guess I waited too late. But it's still like super pretty out here. So on my 21st birthday, we'll be here in like less than three months now. So I'm coming to the age where I'm the oldest, well I'm already the oldest of my friends, as far as being like 21, technically an adult, I'm the oldest of my friends, so I kind of, you know, I have to decide what I want to do for my birthday, and I'm not sure yet what it is I really want to do, because say I want to go to some type of club or bar, my friends aren't going to be able to come, so I kind of have to decide if I want to spend my birthday with my friends, or... If I want to spend it with, say, my sister, who is older than me, and will be able to do some of the things that I want to do. So I'm really not sure yet. I have, I mean, I still have three months just about, but I do have to decide what I want to do. I know that I just wanted to be fun and kind of classy. Like, I feel like because I'm like an adult now, I definitely want it to be kind of classy. So, I don't know yet. If you guys have any ideas for a really freaking great 21st birthday be sure to put it in the comments because you know I'm down for anything just about so I know that because I live in Chicago it's definitely going to get colder before it gets warmer but I am extremely excited for spring to get here and for warmer weather to come you guys do not even understand how excited I am for it to get warm it's gonna be great my dad ordered Lucy on pay-per-view. I wanted to see that movie so badly when it was like in theaters, but I tell you guys, I never go to the movie theater anymore. So I am, so I'm super, super excited that he ordered it because I'm watching it now. Oh yeah. Two good movies in one day, guys. Oh, who's winning? Oh, it's me. <laughs> And I'm also uploading the vlog, so that shit is going up later than it has in a while. But it'll be up uh, soon. It still has a little bit. But yes, 
it still has a little bit of like rendering to do like an hour and a half sorry but yesterday was a pretty eventful day so the vlog is longer than it usually is that's why it's taking so long so i just received an email from netflix telling me that the interview the new like very controversial movie uh with jim franco and seth rogan is on netflix so as soon as i finish lucy i'm gonna go and watch that so basically i'm declaring today movie day okay so i just finished lucy and my question is did lucy become god like i, I i'm a little confused by the ending i think that um, they kind of left it up to perception but is she has she become like a a sort of god or is close to being god is i mean it's really confusing to me but it was a good movie i'm just a little confused about the end so i'm not much of like a junk food eater i've never been one it especially like sweet junk food like candy and cakes and twinkies and stuff like that i've never loved it but however but however this crumble cake it's by um it's cinnamon crumb cakes i mean and it's by cloverville might i say this is the best tasting like sweet junk food i've ever had it smells delicious. So I just came with my mom to pick up some food for tonight, some din din, and guess what we're having, guys? Freaking Chinese food. I did not want any Chinese food. I'm not a fan of Chinese food. Like, it's just not really great to me. But, you know, that's what she wanted. So I'm a nice person, and I was just like, okay, whatever. Who cares? Well, guys, today has been a pretty lazy day. Uh, but I had a really good, like, you know, movie day. I enjoyed watching a few movies. I haven't done that in a really long time. So it was nice to catch up on some movies that I have been wanting to see for quite a bit now. But I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here. But of course not before I read you guys a quote from the world of quotes. Alrighty then. The next quote is, sex is a part of nature. I go with nature. <laughs> And that is, of course, Marilyn Monroe. You guys could have guessed that. Um, <laughs> but I'm going to go ahead and bid you guys adieu here and say thanks so much for watching. If you're watching, comment, like, subscribe if you want to. And I will see your beautiful faces tomorrow. Bye.